Hi, I'm Real Genetic Demon, and this is a What's in the Box Extended Edition. Right, okay, so this is our box. Um, it was kindly sent to me by a lovely chap called Benny Williams. I think he's got a YouTube channel, so I'll actually put that in the, the box. Um, he had a box, he's having a little bit of a clear out. He's not keeping his, he's not keeping his Spectrum stuff, but, but he had this box of just tapes, and, and it's huge, it's massive box. It's like so deep with things. Um, but I thought we'd have a little look. Um, I love it when they're not rewound. It's one of my, my personal um, pet hates, but anyway. Um, right, okay, so we've, well, that's a good start. So we've got, we've got one with nothing on it at all. We'll call that one. Let's see what else we've got here. We have got Collapse and the Goonies. That's exciting. It's good something there. We've got a Mega Tape. We have a Christmas a Mega Gift, and somebody's crossed out the Commodore 64 and the gift part of it. So so I'm, I'm assuming it's not for Commodore 64 users. That's the guy. <laughs> that's that's why that's happened. Let's see what else is in here. What else we got? What we got? Big Trouble in Little Chinatown. Oh, that's the Kurt Russell movie where the girls with the green eyes and the red eye. I remember that. It was a weird one. There was two one. It was that like Kim Cattrall, wasn't it? She was the she was the other one when she was younger. Um, River Rescue. We played that before on my channel actually. It's well worth um, looking at. It's quite tough actually, to be honest with you. So big trouble, little chance. What else have we got here? That's another another half rewound blank one. So we're not worried about that. What else have we got coming up? Possibly. Um, we have. Admiral Gaffer Spec. Oh, this is interesting. Kung Fu Has Vegas. Hmm, Kung Fu in Vegas? In Has Vegas. I don't know, somebody spelt very badly. That's interesting, right? Okay, so that's, that one looks like a, a good one for the future. What we got here? Dam Busters. And Ghostbusters, uh, Ghostbusters. I always like Ghostbusters. You can't go wrong with Ghostbusters. Ghostbusters, Ghostbusters on the the Master System is probably the 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 top end of the eight bit generation. It's the same as the. Uh, it's almost the same as the Spectrum. It's almost the same as the Commodore 64. It's almost the same as the um, Amstrad uh, CPC version. So um, it, it's 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 one of my my faves. But anyway, right? Okay. What else have we got in here? Thanks for this, by the way, Benny. I, really, I do appreciate it, mate. I really do. Um, let's have a look. We've got Sidearms Bionic Commanders. This is obviously from a compilation one. Um, Sidearms and Bionic Commanders. So we won't, we won't, it's not really what's on the tape, that one. What else have we got here? Formula Sports Sports of Kings, Formula One, Action Biker, Tapper. I know lots of people are like that. Oh, somebody's actually recorded over one of the original tapes. Psycho Pigs U, UXB. That was the one with that dodgy, dodgy advert that was on it years ago. Sorry, not, not the camera there. Dodgy, dodgy advert. It was, they, they actually used um, sort of a, a page three girl or possibly even a glamour model to, 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 to advertise it. If I find it, I'll stick it on the screen briefly. Book Rogers, we played before recently. That's really quite good, actually. But they've completely written over it. So Psycho Pigs has been written over with that. What else we got in here? Uh, football director, Man United, crossed out. Nothing else though. Uh, oh, I love the, love it, love these ones. Totally random, specky. That's it. These are going to be big though. That's a sixty. That's sixty minutes in total. Thirty minutes per side. Wow, amazing. Right. Okay. What else we got? Oh, you've the, the usual classics. The uh, hungry Horace. And on the other side we have monitor. 64 possibly hmm I wonder if that's Commodore 64 though might be we'll have to I'll have to listen to the sound of that you can tell because the, the Commodore makes sort of the do -do 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 sort of noise is it no not quite I mean, one of those two anyway um what else have we got in here tape number eight a and tape number eight B these are good because these could be could be could be these could be somebody's um, old programs. We like those. Those are the best. Those are the those are the past. Um, Mega Apocalypse and more. I love the way somebody's typed that. Typed it and stuck it on. And this one's got Turbo 64 demos. Oh, maybe 64 on that one as well. No, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Let's see what else we got. Uh, Defender Popeye Slam Ball. Transformers, Mr. Do's Castle, but Cauldron, Bullseye, and two more. Wow! Wow, Brian Jackson, Superstar, Seaside Special, Antis, Antis, whatever it is, Seaside Special. 
Fingini Special Operations and more. Wow, that's, these are really full. These are these are these are these are chocker. Let's just open the spectrum. Right, that one's got no information on it. It has got a line drawn on there though. Look, as if there was something installed. There's something on it. You see that? Might be something on there. This is a good. It's a good compound. A good lot here. Spectrum Scooby Doo. Ah, oh, that was by the. Um, or what they're called. I want to say high tech, but it's not high tech, I don't think, is it? Something tech anyway. Uh, River Raid. We've played River Raid before. That was a that's a that's a, a, a Atari two six hundred game originally. I think it possibly was an arcade game as well, actually. Right, so what else have we got in here? What a lot a lot of tapes. Cookie, can't go wrong. Ultimate game. What else have we got? Gauntlet. And more gauntlet. Can't go wrong with that either. Ant Attack and Kong 2, Ant Attack's a classic, that's one of my favourite early isometric games, not that I'm very into them, but that's one of my favourites, Entombed, mmm, something crossed out, that's interesting, let's see what else we've got here, this one's, this one's well worn, even the, 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 the cover, the, the actual um, label has actually come off with age, I, I like these ones though, because these ones have the best things on them, and sometimes completely don't work, so they're quite cool, let's see what we've got, oh I like it, it says Ricky's tape and Ricky's tape. So Ricky could have could all have all kinds on there. There's a computer cassette. Cool, nice one, Ricky. Right, we got this one here, and this is uh, channel whatever else it is. Graphics, shooting, programming, commandos, arrays, dims. Oh, look, this could actually be somebody's whole load. Oh, teach it yourself. Oh wow. Oh wow. A Texas Instruments is that for? Is that for? And it says pulling out the camera view. Sorry about that. Is that for the the actual Timex version? Don't know. That's interesting. We must have a look at that one. Just an, as a general aside, somebody's actually done all this and written it down. That's kind of interesting. Right. Okay. Carry on. That's me, expert. And uh, expert again. Wow. I wonder what else on there. Oh, 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 Jazz Samara UFO. Wow, okay, fair enough. Jazz, Jazz, Yas, Yas Shimara? That's, I, I don't even know what that is. That's, that's, that's obviously some, probably Japanese. 1942 Cyber something or other. It's a cyborg, I think, actually, on there. Let's have a look. Way of the Tiger, can't beat it. Way of the Tiger, twice, because, you know, why not? Let's see what else we've got. There's a huge stack of these. That's another blank one, I think. Yeah, it's totally blank. Let's have a look. Oh, Ashes Games. Let's have a look. Let's see. And, oh, it's, uh, we don't, we, well, let's not be rude, eh? Mind you, to be fair, contextually, it might not be quite the same as what we think it is, but uh, yeah, right, okay. Ashes Games. Anyway, Ashes Games. Maybe he was having a happy day. It wasn't quite what we thought it was going to be there. Let's have a little look. Aztec Tomb. No other information. Aztec Tomb. Now that's a 64 game that I know of definitely. I don't know if it came out on the Spectrum. Various games. More various games. Oh, you can't go wrong with a bit of uh, um, Crash. I don't know if I've got that one actually, to be honest with you. That's kind of cool. Except the tape's not the same. <laughs> Brilliant. Love it. Operation Wolf. And something else. Acceleron. Acceleron? Excel Excel Acceleron. Yeah, it would that, well I probably actually have the tape for that, funnily enough, somewhere. So so that's not so bad really. Right, let's carry on. Let's see what we've got in here. Uh an imagine game. Inventor that that one? Ace of Aces, I'm guessing that is, because that's usually what that is when they call it like that. Let's see what else we've got. Oh, we've got quite, a, we've got quite a selection in here, actually. Games. Games. Fully loaded, obviously. This was like halfway through when I did that. More. What we got here? Uh, nothing. Good old Memorex. That's how I started this series, you know, with a Memorex. It's a Memorex. No faults and Stormlord. Stormlord's a classic. Stormlord is a classic. That's uh, Maelstrom and Batman. Batman didn't work this week. I was quite disappointed by that, actually, if I'm honest. Um, who else we got? 
Um, we have Morse code. Chess prep sub Silver Mountain. Okay, that's interesting. Uh, thalamus. Uh, that's probably going to be um, C64. I don't remember many Thalamus games on the Spectrum, but you never, you never know. We'll give it a try. We'll see what happens. Um, good old Outrun. I've got Outrun somewhere actually, the full version of it. So that's cool. Let's see what we've got. Blade Warrior. Now I know Mr. Birdsell played that one actually not too long ago. Blade Warrior. Let's have a dig around here. What else we got in here? I had no idea what was coming. BMX Racers. Um, another Memrex. Computer cassette this time around. Somebody asked this question the other day. Was there a difference between the computer cassettes and 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 sort of the normal recording ones you got from home? The, the, a thought that crossed my mind is it was probably they were meant to be maybe higher quality as computer cassettes, possibly. Uh, training section for load accounts. Load accounts. Loading time three minutes and thirty seconds. No idea what that is. Okay, let's go. Let's see what else we've got. God, we're getting through these now. Uh, we have Alley Cat C64 game, definitely. Personalities. Split personalities, that's a great game, that. Split personalities. It's basically a spitting image game, but it's not. It's not meant to be a spitting image game. So we have Quake something like Whirl Whirling Nerds. Quaked Port 2. Star Wars Strongman Iridium. We'll see. We've got to try a few of the tape beforehand to make sure that we don't get C64 games. Rider. Um, Night Rider. I watched that the other day. I watched it when he first met him, when he first met Kit and Kit started talking. And he was just really rude to Kit. I mean, feel very sorry for Kit, but anyway. So, um, Miami Vice. Bit of, bit of 80s nostalgia TV there. Uh, computer tape. Matsui. You know, I just wonder what happened to some of these films, because they were big in the day. Um, I, I mean, and I assume some of these went bust and whatever else it is. Pity your words against the computer. Awa. Awa. Wawi. Awa. Nova Dive, somebody's written over the top of it. Oh. Or is it Aqua Dive? Aqua Dive! Ugh, Nova Dive. Didn't get an end from there. Um, this one is Cauldron by High Tech. It was High Tech. It was, I was right the first time round. High Tech. This is Forbidden Forest. This is a. Wow, low time. 9 minutes 40. It's definitely a C64 game, that. 9 minutes 40. Get a cup of coffee. You can have two in that time. Okay, Crash. Um, January 1990. I wonder if that was the tape that was there earlier. Okay, let's have a look. What we got here? Super Soccer. We've got a Lee, a Delta Wing. Kept the final wish. I, I wasn't never a fan of those ones really. Not too bad a tape. Assuming it's the right one. Crash October. Yes, it is. Well done, Betty. Uh, okay, uh, another. Blank one, excellent. What else have we got here? Another one without anything on. TKD. We've got quite a few of them actually. Oh, Iridium for the Spectrum. Cool. Excellent game. Brilliant shooter. Never play it properly. Uh, Beyond the Ice Castle. I always quite like this really. Um, I don't know why. Um, I don't think it was a particularly. I think it was a. Wasn't it a port from an Atari 2600 game, an arcade game of the same name? Ooh. Power Pack doesn't sound. Is that is that Com is that Amstrad or is it Commodore? Don't know. Might ha might find might find a nice Commodore user for some of these. Thrill Time. Oh yes. Um, Deep Strike. Uh, nothing else. That's actually on there. It doesn't say anything else. All right. Okay. Oh, excited now. Still quite a way to go. Yeah, actually, it's quite deep. Let me see what we've got here. And we have. Checkbook balance. Oh right, okay. Compu fruit. Um, compound interest. Somebody's home programs by the. Oh yeah, that's what we like. Home programs. Home programs. Computer programs. Oh, that's what we want. Those are the ones. Those are those. Those. Those are the. Those are the. Those are the things we really, really want. Oh, these are the electronic distributed ones. This is this company that not a lot of people like these, but they basically they wrote they they that you could you could go right to them and they would send them to you and they basically it was another way of distributing games. And um, you sometimes saw them in places. It was kind of it was kind of like copy your own rather than selling whatever else it is. Double Dragon. Let's have a look down 
this side. Uh, Super Soccer, an Adidas football demo. What else have we got here? We've got the Viz Playable demo, Gunsmoke, Goldmine, um, Temple of whatever it's called, Dynamite Dan. Oh, wow. Three games. Wow, I didn't know they were all on there. Great fight. Wow. We need to try some of these. Well, that's a good one, like that. Let's see what we've just got in here. Spectrum. Issue number three. ASP Computing. ASP Software, sorry. Uh, let's have a little look and see what it's, whether we can get any more details out of it. Maybe there's nothing, there's nothing more on it, I'm afraid. Interesting. I like these mystery ones. I'm liking these. These are cool. Dustin, a game that I played recently again. Remember loving it, can't remember how to play it at all. <laughs> It's a cover tape game, and I can't remember what it was. Uh, it was really nice. The graphics are good. Now, Space Raiders 2. Oh, I love Space Raiders 2. I don't even know if I own a copy of it, but Space Raiders 2 is just one of my favourite games of all time. Um, I'm definitely, uh, or I certainly believe it is. Um, I'm going to have to put that on, actually. I'm sure I love Space Raiders 2. Well, I'll look at that one anyway. I'm thinking maybe, maybe I'm thinking of 3D of Star Strike, but anyway. Some more. City Slickers. And the tapes in there. Cool. Oh, thanks, Benny. This is really cool, mate. Um, non Terracuas, Mount Maquette, Ultimate Warrior. That was that's a t that's that's a, just a created with the uh, CRL 3D creator. Just isometric thing. You basically only had to get out the mines in them. Uh, gauntlet. Can't be a great gauntlet. What else we got here? We have a bit of Christmas tape. It looks like the back of it. Oh no, no, it's what they are. Demos, Apocalypse, more Football Manager. We got. I'm running out of space on the table behind the when I'm pulling this out. So much stuff, so much stuff. Mastertronic Street Hassle. I don't remember Street Hassle to be honest. With you. Oh, the tape stuck down here. Oh, it's boots. Cybertron Mission and Kickstart. Like Kickstart. Let's see what else we got in here. Let's whiz through them all. We have Gilligan's Gold. Oh, I love Gilligan's Gold. Have I got that yet? I don't know if I have on my collection. That's one of those things that I. I keep meaning, Gilligan's Gold is a copy of, oh now, remember, I can't remember its name. It's an arcade game with the same name, you're basically collecting gold from a mine, you're sort of the bad guy actually. Collecting gold from a mine and you kind of have to get in and out of it. It's not actually bad as a conversion. Uh, what else have we got here? Zap, uh, Mega Tape, that's definitely 64. Let's see what else we've got in here. Oh, more Gilligan's Gold. Andrew Wildenbuck. Um, Alien Destroyer, there's about 4 million of those out there in the world. Mega Tape, Zap, it's 1991. Definitely 64, a few games on there. Oh, Beachhead, I tried to load this the other week, do you remember this? We had the Beachhead 1 and Beachhead 2, um, and I couldn't, I got the covers completely mixed up, um, but I definitely tried to load them, I remember that. Let's have a look. Players Premier, Moving Target. Another one of those ones of those. There may be a few lucky people out there who actually get some duplicates at this rate. Always be good to move on your retro stuff if you can to some to, to, to other collectors. It's really nice. It's a nice thing to do. Light gun games. That's awesome. I'm sitting a bit too far up. We've got Blaster. Master Blaster. Rockfall. I think we've had another one of them before, haven't we? Just check tapes in there. Yeah, tapes there. And this right one as well. Yeah, April 19th. Uh, we have, oh, this is one of these Dixon's tapes, Dixon's four packs. Oh, it's the 128K version. That's cool. That's probably a little bit more uncommon to get 128K version or something. A lot of these were not 128K. However, I'm not entirely sure I remember um, Colin the Cleaner, Blizzard Pass, um, what's that one? Can't see it. And whatever that is in the bottom corner. Even with my glasses and I can't see that. But that's, that's a little bit more uncommon, that, as far as I can tell. Uh, we have Operation Thunderbolt and the Lost City, an original adventure. Cool. We have... I'm just watching as all these tapes fall off the edge of the table behind me. Rockman. Oh, you've done this one before. Super Sleuth. Um, Spectre Bad Dad. If you loaded that in 128k mode, you were all of a sudden given infinite lives. Spotted that a while ago. I can't remember who it was. Um, one of the people on my, my, on my comments on my channel regularly said that this was, was a common thing. They realised that they could do that. Uh, Trantor. Um, Moron Atlantis. 
a loopy adventure, Master Brain. North and South, I used to love North and South, but that was on the Amstrad, um, no, I'm sorry, on the uh, Amiga. However, it is on the Amstrad, I believe, as well. And it's quite a quite nice con conversion on that. Okay, some tapes here are gonna fall off if we don't do anything about them. Tape cleaning, can't be that. Exclusive, oh, 20 games from there. Wow, it's part of the pack though. So we've got the Freddy Hardest Part 1 and 2, Basket Master. Oh, forgot about Basket Master. That was a really good one on one um, basketball game. I remember really enjoying that. Um, Legend of Cage, Game Over, um, Part 1 part one and Part 2. That's with the, the naughty lady in there and the naughty pictures. Um, right. Okay, where are we are. Oh, look, we've got. Kamikaze Bear, or my mates like to call him Banzai, um, on there. That, we've done that one before, before, on this thing. Frankenstein CRL, oh wow, that's an adventure. It's quite, un it's quite, it's quite uncommon and it's quite sought after nowadays, actually. That's nice, that's nice, I like that. Uh, games and demos, I love that. Just games, they've just given up. Mega, Mega, Mega Tape 6, just games. It's just got games on there. Just load it, we don't care. Good games. Right, okay, next. Let's go. Let's go. Eddie the Eskimo. Uh, or Eskimo Eddie. Um, Jason's Gems, Egghead. By, that's Jonathan Caldwell, isn't it? That's just one of his games. Oh, Tato's Coin Up Hits. I actually have a copy of this, I think. No, I don't. Because I don't recognise some of the games on it. No, I don't. That's fine. <laughs> I'm running out of space here. I'm running out of space. Slowly running out of space. Uh, Maelstrom, we saw that before. Batman demo. Uh, American football gameplay. Move that over there and chuck them on the other seat. Let's see what we've got here. Flashpoint. Um, and I can't see the bottom bit there because it says something over the top of it. M MCA Masters. Never heard of that. Power Drift. And. We have Dynamite Dan. Oh, where were you the other week when I needed a copy of Dynamite Dan? Huh? <laughs> needed a copy of that the other week. Anyway, Olympic Spectacular. That's, I never played that one. Let's have a little look. We're digging deep now. We're digging deep. Let's see. Uh, six full place games. And obviously, this is Beam Software. That is Horace and the Spiders. Because it says Spiders there. Beam Software, Horace and the Spiders, that one. Let's see, does it tell us what they are? Oh, it does. Rygar, Solomon's Key, Silver... Didn't that have to give you a lot of good games so towards the end of the, the lifespan of things, didn't they? Taipei, Colosseum, Titanic, Battle Command. They did, they really went over overboard with those final tapes. So it's really kind of a, a, a sad scenario that, that, that that's where they went to with them. Anyway, Video Vault, Spectrum Games, uh, Jolly Roger, Devil's Descent. Oh, well, there's a mixture of things on there, that's interesting. I wonder if there's what's on the back. Nothing. Let's notice down there. That's fair enough. Okay. Uh, School Days, an absolute classic. Uh, Nomad, Bulbo and the Lizard King. Played that before, actually. You've seen that on my channel before. We did that on one of the What's on Tapes. Can't remember which one, though. Quickly through the rest of them. Amsoft Welcome Tape. Chaos, an absolute donking game i mean it's like one of the best and so expensive to buy got what a nightmare it is i mean the original firebird one i would i would i would possibly you know i don't know sacrifice something to the to the devils of of, of collecting for for, for for a copy of that original um i've got a couple on the on on tape like this but uh and i hang on to them sorry guys i don't 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 pull them out because they're, they're so good it's more i'm soft Oh, it's taunting me. We're here again. Frank Bruno's boxing. It only actually ever loads on the 48k Spectrum. Rubber key one as well. Um, I think it probably works on the 48k plus as well. But uh, um, it does never get a thing to load. It's brilliant though. It's really good, but it never bloody loads. Um, so, excuse language. Um, scuba dive. Brilliant. Elite. There's a few good ones here actually. Surface tension. You know, nuclear countdown. I can't tell what nuclear countdown is. I think I have it. I can't remember what it is. Anyway, so, but yeah, surface tension. What well, else? Cool. Cool, 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 cool. What else have we got here? Death Zone and Space Harrier 2. Death Zone. It's got to be good. It's an exclusive 3D attack. A, a 3D space action, sorry. 
Death Zone. Disco, da Disco Dan. It actually um, went out originally as an original game. I guess that's probably got some sort of value to it. Glider Rider, really weird game, beautiful. Isometric again, um, but you turn into a glider, but you mostly bike around. It's kind of weird, but good. Let's have a little look and see what else we've got in here. Okay, through now. Alien Syndrome, oh, Spectrum version of that. I remember playing that quite a lot, actually. It's sort of a top-down 3D sort of shooter. It's quite good, actually, though. I quite like it. Um, what else have we got here? Crazy Golf. Nice. Oh, you've made my day. I tried to buy a copy of this recently, um, the, the Covenant. Um, I tried to buy that for, for for the Spectrum, and I lost out big style. It just went for for for, for silly money. It's a, it's it's just one of those games that I've wanted and I've really really wanted. And I don't even think it's that good, but it just looked great. And on the Amstrad C P C, which is where I first played it, I was I thought it was absolutely fantastic. I really did. So I've always wanted the Spectrum version of it. Magnificent Seven. Good selection on there. Complete game, Rampage. You can't beat a bit of Rampage. That's really good. I know they've made a movie out of it recently. Um, I watched the movie. I wasn't totally on... I, I, it was silly enough that I could kind of get on with it. Nothing to do with the computer game, of course. Right, and to finish off, we have more of my uh, friend uh, Dan Dare there. Dan Dare Special Edition. Ooh, Street Fighter as well. Cool. Wow, I'm excited about some of these. Oh, and never in my wildest dreams. Maze ball. No idea what that is. And we finish with uh, with uh, International Karate. That's awesome. Anyway, that was brilliant. That was kind of a prelude anyway to um, a big empty box. And prelude to, I'm going to show you some tape. Look, there you go. We've taken it here. Uh, it was a prelude to what's on the tape. Um, we got, you know, sort of a special one off because I've got a big box full there. And I just thought it was so cool. I've got to open them like that. Anyway, I've been your host, Real Genetic Demon. Thank you for watching. Please feel free to like and subscribe. And I'll catch you in the next video. Bye bye now.